my name is Diane DeAnker. I've been on the board for six years. Um, I used to be a teacher for Toledo Public Schools and I am now retired and serve on the boards of both Lucas Soil and Water and Wild Ones and um, also for the Natural Science Tech Center. And my favorite thing that the Lucas Soil and Water Conservation Service does is the outreach that they do with children in various different settings, um, school groups and conservation groups and uh, just uh, Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, things in that order. Um, they really get the word out about the conservation practices and the importance of preserving our natural Oh, I'm Steve Leffler. Uh, I've been on the board, I guess, for nine years. I'm a Lucas County farmer in the Berkey Swanton area. And uh, I'm very proud of our staff and at Lucas Soil and Water. And over the years, I think we've made fiscally and the staff a lot more. Uh, I would think efficient and I'm very proud of the direction Lucas County and what DJ Mears is doing for the ditch projects. We are five decades behind and I think the improvements there, I, landowners are going to really appreciate and the conservation, getting the ball going with the cover crops and being the H2O pro Ohio program is uh, a huge improvement to our water quality and the environment in Lucas County. I'm Jim Vogelbacher. I've been on the board for a little over three years. I'm a farmer in eastern Lucas County. And I think the education of the school kids that's performed from our office is a good thing. Hi, I'm Tom Schoen. I, uh, been a board member since 2014. It's probably the favorite thing I do because, uh, well, I'm a landscape designer and educator. I uh, taught at Owens, and uh, I think the my favorite thing about my role with the conservation district is setting lands aside for conservation. I would be remiss uh, not to mention our small but mighty tribe. We have the best group, we could use more people, but it's amazing what our group is able to accomplish as really an understaffed group, but they're all tremendously talented, and they're all great educators, and I'm really proud of them.